scary one. I'm going to do the mermaid look um, using the, the purple. So I'm going to be using the purple, which doesn't have the name on here. And looking at it in the light, it's got like purple, gold, like olive. <laughs> it's kind of like a lot of things going on in there. And unfortunately, the names are not on the shadows. Um, and I'm doing the red, um, I think something crush on my lips because they didn't make a purple one. And I'll be using the uh, Midnight Moon, which my daughter tells me has like an aqua um, iridescence to it. So what I put in my eyes is my Barbie, for, I think it's Stila. Yeah my Barbie because it's got so much like fuchsia um, iridescence in it purpley fuchsia so that's what I put on my lid and so the eyeshadows I will be using is from the uh, from the lust palette right here I think I'm gonna use this uh, the purple just to transition and I'm going to take a little bit because last time I used that, it was really, really dark. It looks like a just a straight up purple, but when you put it on, it is a really, really deep, deep purple. And I, everybody is putting shadows on first as a base before they put that on. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to take the this uh, black with the purple fuchsia -y glitter. It looks like it matches it perfectly, so... Let's get that on the brush and let's just get that on. I wasn't sure if I need uh, lashes, but I do. <laughs> and I'm going to use the pretty pink in the palette and just put that as the. Um, Highlight color. Using the same brush, I'm just gonna go in a little bit with a little bit more of that purple. To kind of offset that that uh, black color. It's really dark in and of itself. Alright, I'm not gonna use any of the liners for this. But let's see, see how this goes. I like. I don't know if you can tell, but I just try to get get it more purple than black. Hmm. Me like. Again, just get that toned down a little bit by blending the that pretty pink highlight color into the uh, you know, blend that harsh line out. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna need lashes, but I, I like that. I really, really like that purple um cream and it does dry down matte. Um well you know dries down. It's not matte. It's definitely glitter. Me like it. Alright, let me finish my makeup and I'll be right back. Hey everyone. So this is the finished look. Um, so yeah, this is a gold, but it's got a, like an aqua sheen to it. Like someone said it made her skin look gray. I was just, you know, watching some reviews on YouTube. My daughter said it looked more like a sea foam color, um, like a sea green. Yeah, I've been using the, the Dolce or the Dolce, um, bronzer because I got it like on a sale and I had a coupon and I, it's, it's. It's got it's got that rose color, and I noticed in my past couple of videos it made my skin look red. So now I'm just using it to like tone down the highlight and blend the blushing. 
But anyway, um, so yeah, and sometimes I also notice that my uh, my concealer, uh, it like highlights too. I'm not sure why. So as I move my face, it looks like I've got, I didn't blend it in, but I did. I don't know. But it, it happened to me before with I think the benefits erase space. But anyway, so um. So yeah, I use the red and the purple. I, oh my gee, I just love it. I love how it looks. It dries down so it's not gonna crease. And this, um, this definitely dries down. Um, I noticed that the, the coral and this crush one, um, they dry down really fast. The blue and the green don't dry out down as well. But, um, so that's what I'm gonna be doing for the next four weeks is, um, you know, if there's no interruptions in life um, <laughs> so that's uh that's what i'll be doing is the mermaid um, collection